is fine. Uh, you, you can't attack this hole today, but must be in the fairway. The right side does give you a slightly better angle, but... Which means, you, yeah, which means you have to challenge that bunker down the right. There's water to the right of that, but play towards the trouble on this hole. And that one scuttles all the way down to the low part of her. People give him credit for it. Yeah, this one hanging a little left from Orikawa. Really struggling with his direction today. Stayed up on top, landed softly. And uh, with that whole location that Mark mentioned, front left, he required a different shot shape to get to. 70 old greens are soft. We're still trying to land three short, right? Yeah, a little bit of an upslope. And again, the wind's going to help off his right, so if he wants to set it out to the right, yeah, certainly doable here. Flat lie up here, just a little bit below his feet. It's one that you would like to get close to the flag, but just don't miss left. Work away from that. Okay? Yeah, this one's hanging right towards the right front. Not bad, though. Yeah, that's very good. Over on the bay, you want to sort of just string some good shots together. That does wander away with that fall off in the front here as well. That's what makes those front hole locations of this golf course so difficult. There are many greens. There's that gentle fall off in the front of the second on the way into the par five here for Howell. 277, so trying to force it up there as close as you can. Three wood, three wood, and we'll get you right in front. Sweet drive at the fifth, tumble all the way down yep. to the bottom there. For a lot of them haven't held. What that? I think it's a good number. Okay. Yeah, right now I do too. At 139, there's also a slope behind the hole along the left hand side you could use as well if you didn't want to. One thing he's got to be careful of the spin if he doesn't hit it far enough. And spin back to the front. Oh, he likes the number. That's it's right now turning right at the flag stick. When you like the number of the wedge uh, in your hand, you can go flag there. hunting. I just, like, it has to be passive with no spin, you know? That's fine there, but it wasn't a great number in my opinion. It's a good call by you, though. He will wait. More cow will have the first birdie opportunity here. And this is a really slow putt. Comparatively speaking, it's, it's almost about a foot and a half, close to two feet above where he's standing. Just a little bit of right to left in this. That's one thing you would struggle with when you change grips, which he's had with the saw grip. And another great look from behind right here. trying on you. Tough on the nerves, even. We'll move to the sixth. Short positional par four, but Spieth has gone with driver here twice this week now, Carr. That's why I'm playing directly into the breeze, but front right hole location, I would think this hole could play quite challenging today. This ball down the right center. It's going to be all right, but that's going to be a tough angle. That may chase to the rough, though. It sure did. Uh, Craig, I, I, I get it. It's in the breeze, but I, I, I got another hole where driver's not necessary. I, I don't get it. I'm just, I'm sitting here scratching my head going, no, this is a position A to position P golf course. I talked about the geometry of it. And it's all about relationships to points and lines. And that's the formula that you need. You need to be a tactician. And I have no idea why you hit driver off this tee. I have really no idea why you hit driver off the fourth. But these guys are in control of what they're trying to do. The percentages are better in play here, Mark. 
I'm going to do exactly what Colin did here. A little fairway wood down the left center of the fairway. It's three it's and a great angle. It's a three wood and a nine iron for a front hole location. <laughs> What's going on? in the limit of these hole locations today for round three. That's, ooh, that's a big miss there. Dead man out of sorts right now. Go My nearest point, can I go back into the fairway, which might give him a fraction better angle. This is, this is exactly where I would stand for the shot, lining up in the corner of that bunker. So I just wanted you to tell me if you think that the extension of that is... Yeah, you're right on the ground. Yeah, ground. so that counts. Yeah. Okay. So going back, probably, right there. Yeah, uh, yeah. Versus going forward, it seems like I would be further, right? Yeah. You'll be right. right there. Yep. I, just, I just wanted to triple check, just yep. based on the line that I have to take. Like, if I could go at the hole, I didn't think it was like, what? What a break card. Yeah, it certainly is going to help. I mean, he's obviously going to be able to control the spin more with this. Still, there's no edge on a flight zone. It's not so. cutting it in there. I mean, it's 100 yards. You want to pitch it a couple past, right? Yeah, I'd say five past. No. Oh. 102 is playing another five or six, right? Maybe like a 110 shot. Yeah, I'd say 10 ish. Okay, there should be enough freeze. Yeah, there's definitely enough freeze. could go upstairs here, Craig, but I think really the shot is kind of a hold on little kind of punch wedge here. I need to hit one more plug or you think this is still fine? Oh, I mean, it's cutting it in there. Yeah, I understand. It's 100 yards. Just wait till you get the wind you like. I know. To me, anyway, it was so pleasurable to listen to the honest that Jordan asked the rules official about. He wasn't trying to gain anything. The place was such wonderful decorum, as Mr. Speed. And it's going to land past, but he's going to spin a lot. Jeez. You know, I've seen guys in situations like that. Or did that thing just go? I mean, that was no chance. Or Cal and Mr. Green up here at the sixth. Sounds like what you're saying would have been much better off in the bunker, Mark. I don't think there's any question because his ball's below his feet, tough stance. I mean, it just you have to play this golf course as it's laid out to you, you're not preparing anything around the, at the Players' Championship except to try and lift the trophy. That's why it could also be that going with the fairway little downhill right here that's going to lead to his right the whole way. about 15 yards, 382, but it's brought with danger for sure. Uh, absolutely, and I think you know, when you have a shorter hole, this is a very complicated green complex, as you pointed out, with different sections, so many slopes. And really, if you miss this green, not a lot of easy up and downs around this green. Right, moving 
further right. Really? It's going to miss those moguls and mounds. Visually make these players feel so uncomfortable. The water and that long bunker down the, the left, and hit it towards those three staggered bunkers on the right. Pete Dye said, the players just misinterpret me. It looks hard, but it really doesn't play that hard. I'm not sure that's quite the case here at seven. Yeah, I, would, I would disagree with his statement. <laughs> right, that should miss that bunker. This could be really good. Challenge, obvious trouble down the left. Now, excellent angle of that whole location, back right part.